how to root pixel experience plus or normal edition without having access to a computer and without DWRP recovery. Hey peeps, what's up Manchi here, back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can root pixel experience ROM to normal or the plus edition without a computer and without TWRP recovery. So this here is the POCO F1 which is right now running pixel experience plus edition based on Android 12. Now as I mentioned earlier the steps will remain the same even if you are using the normal edition which means that that is the non plus edition now. What are the things which you need? You need access to a USB OTG drive and an internet connection on your phone that is what you need so you will go to the releases page of magisk on github you will be on a page like this herein we will scroll down and of course all the relevant links are in the description of the video so once you scroll down you will reach the assets section if it is not expanded for you tap on the arrow beside it and it is going to be expanded and download the latest magisk apk at the time of recording this video it is version 25.1 we tap on it and we say okay so this is going to download the file on my device next thing we need to do is we need to install this apk so we will go to the files application and once we are inside the files application we will go into apps and then go into app installs and select the magisk apk and if it tells you that hey files by google needs to have permission to install apks on your device you have to enable the toggle and then we are going to say install now while the installation is going on we can go back and here it is magisk was installed without any issues and now in my application drawer i have the magisk application now do note this is the magisk application we have installed we have not yet rooted our device and that is also clear by the fact that in the app itself it tells you that magisk is not applicable the app which we just installed is version 25.1 one. The next thing we need to do is we are going to connect our USB OTG drive to the device and then we have to transfer the magisk file to the USB OTG. So for that once you have connected your USB OTG you should get a notification here it is Samsung USB drive is connected. Then we can open the files application one more time and we can go back to the main page. So here it is. This is the main page of the files application. I have my internal storage. I have the type C. Let us go into internal storage. We will go into download. Why? Because this is where the magisk APK which we had downloaded is present. So what we can do is we can tap on the three dot menu on the right hand side of the file name and we are going to say copy to here and it will give you an option so we're going to select type c and then you have to choose the folder in your type c so let us choose the download folder and say copy here now the file has been copied successfully to our usb otg drive however we are still in internal storage on the top you can see it says internal storage let us go back go back one more time so this again is the main page of the files application go into type c and go into download here it is the magisk apk is present over here on the top it says type c and here in next thing you need to do is you need to rename this file so again three dot on the right hand side of the file and say rename and remove the dot apk and give it the name dot zip and say okay and rename so there it is file extension was changed it is now magisk hyphen version 25.1 dot zip next thing we need to do is we need to boot into our recovery so first of all turn off your device once the device has turned off press and hold power and volume up till you see your recovery and you should boot into the pixel experience recovery so i see the poco logo and pretty soon i should see the recovery there it is pixel experience recovery now once you have booted into your pixel experience recovery the next thing we need to do is flash the magisk zip file however here is a pro tip for you if you are not able to boot into your pixel experience recovery with the usb otg connected disconnect the usb otg 
boot into your pixel recovery again power and volume up keep it pressed till you boot into your recovery and then you can connect your usb otg wait for a few seconds for it to detect your usb otg so here it is this is the main page of the pixel experience recovery we are going to say apply update then we are going to say choose from samsung usb and in your case the name could be different and here and we need to scroll and find the folder where we have the magisk zip in our case we had it in the download folder so we will go into download select the magisk zip and that's it the process has now started we are routing our pixel experience rom without having access to a computer and without twrp recovery and based on the speed of your usb otg it might take some time so all you need to have is some patience and there it is once the process has finished successfully it will tell you done and at that point you can select back from the top of the recovery screen install was completed all you need to do next is say reboot system now and at this point feel free to disconnect your usb otg in case you want to do that because you don't need it anymore to flash magisk device should be rooted by now now once we have booted back into android we can of course unlock our device go into the magisk application and bam here it is you can see magisk is now installed previously it was not applicable now you have the version of the app and of magisk itself which means we have successfully rooted pixel experience based on android 12 without having access to a computer and without twrp recovery and that will do it for this video Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.